click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in this video we are going to see problems based on normal distribution. Let us start with problem number one. In a test on 2000 electric bulbs, it was found that the life of particular make was normally distributed with average life of 2040 hours and standard deviation of 60 hours. Estimate the number of bulbs likely to burn for between 1920 hours to 2160 hours and second one is more than 2150 hours given that a of 2 is equal to 0.4772 and a of 1.83 is given as 0.4664 now in normal distribution mean is represented by the symbol mu so here you can see normally distributed with average life so average life basically stands for mean which is given as 2040 hours then they have given a standard deviation standard deviation is denoted by sigma which is equal to 60 hours number of electric bulbs can be considered as capital n which is equal to 2000 In the next step, we will find the standardized value of x which is given by z is equal to x minus mean upon sigma. So its general formula will be x minus 2040 upon 60. x is the probability that is asked in the question. We can see different numbers say like 1920, 2160 and 2150. So we can consider x as these three values and find the three standardized value of x. So if I consider x as 1920 hours, the standardized value z will be 1920 minus 2040 upon 60 that will give you minus 120 upon 60 which will be equal to minus 2. Similarly, if I consider the second value of x as 2160, the standardized value will be equal to 2. And for third value of x that is 2150 the answer will be 1.83 now in the first part they have asked you to find the estimate number of bulbs likely to burn from between 1920 hours to 2160 hours so the value of x should be between 1920 and 2160 So this expression will represent the life of the bulb from 1920 to 2160. That can be also written in terms of standardized value of z. For 1920 the standardized value was minus 2 and for 2160 it was plus 2. But the medial variable will be now z. Now area from z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 2 will be a of 2 and a of 2 is already given in the question that is 0.4772 on multiplication with 2 the final answer will be 0.9544 this is the answer of the first part in the second part they have asked you that more than 2150 hours Now for number of hours to be greater than 2150, its standardized value that is z should be greater than 1.83. That can be also written as area to the right of z is equal to 1.83. That we can write it as area to the right of z is equal to 0 minus area from z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 1.83 
here area to the right of z is equal to 0 is nothing but a by 0 that is already given which is equal to 0 0.5 and the value of the second bracket will be 0 0.4664 that will give you 0 0.0336 now in the first case and the second case we have found out the probability now to convert this in terms of number of bulbs we will multiply the answer by 2000 as this process is carried out for 2000 bulbs so for the first case the probability was 0 0.9544 and number of bulbs is 2000 that will give you 1908.8 approximately 1909 bulbs so these bulbs will be burning between the given hours and in the second case there will be 67 bulbs which will be working over 2150 hours and that can be obtained by its probability into 2000 i hope friends you have understood this problem thank you for watching this video stay tuned with igida and subscribe to igida